What's up? It's D Marie Love on Keep It Scripted. I'm back with another reaction. I don't know why it feels like it's been so long since I've done this type of reaction video like on this channel, but it feels like it's been forever and it hasn't been this long. Either way, I missed you guys and I'm glad to be back and having something else really exciting to react to and talk about. So, Telltale. Anybody who knows me knows how much I am in to Telltale games. This mashup of Telltale and DC is just like everything I could ask for in a game. Now I'll be honest, all this walking, all this buzz around Walking Dead season three, I'm more, a lot more excited for that and I kind of just want more details and more trailers on Walking Dead season three, but it's okay because you know, I know that's coming. So now I'm gonna be getting more details about Batman and Batman is my second favorite DC character. So, I mean, if there was a superhero I had to choose for them to do a game on, it would probably be him. I'm so excited to see what they have in store for us and it better be good or I'm gonna have some words. <laughs> Lots of violence, blood, and drug references. That's what you need in a good Bruce, Batman game. You can't keep doing this. Step out of the shadows. Don't let tombstones be your family legacy. He looks good. Wow, this doesn't look like a Telltale game. This looks like I a cartoon. To a myth. Doesn't it kind of look like a cartoon? Just remember, there is room for Bruce and Batman inside that suit. Oh my God. I love it already. And nothing's happened. This city has burned with corruption and greed. With Bruce's help, a vote for Harvey Dent is a vote to finally put your foot down. Vicki Vale, reporter for the Gotham Gazette. Is the Dent campaign soliciting votes from Gotham's biggest crime family? Money gets money. I can get Harvey the mayor's seat, or I can pull it out from under. Your father despised men like Falcone. No one has ever managed to bring him down. Wow. I haven't tried yet. That Batman voice is on point. The fire is heading this way. You must show the world the true nature of a Wade. Sometimes I think this whole city is a crime scene. A revolution is knocking on Gotham's door. When this whole thing starts, make sure you're on the right side. All right, good. They're showing more Batman stuff. That's good. I was getting worried for a second there. Time to save the city. Ooh. Realm of Shadows. Okay. Okay, so like, okay. I'm gonna say this. So, I had heard prior to the release of this trailer leading up to this that this game was gonna focus a lot on bruce wayne and you know i was like okay that's fine um i just kind of hoped that it wasn't gonna be getting into like the history of bruce wayne and his past because we have seen that eight hundred thousand times like we don't need to see that anymore so it doesn't really look like that's what they're doing which is good i was watching the trailer and i was like okay i'm seeing a lot a lot a lot of bruce and a lot of bruce looking at batman's suit I kind of want to see him in the suit being Batman um, and then they started to show like a little bit more Batman action which is cool so hopefully it'll be like a good balance like playing as Bruce Wayne will be cool that will be cool but like let's just be honest people like Batman a lot more than they like Bruce okay it's not Bruce Wayne isn't like a, a Tony Stark who's like just as entertaining outside of his suit like I'm sorry it's, that's that's just my personal opinion, but I do love Batman. The graphics looked a little different than what I'm used to seeing from Telltale. At first, I was like, that kind of looks cartoonish. Like, it looks good, but it just kind of looked cartoonish. Like, it's not like they're walking that game when they kind of make it look like it's like a moving comic book panel. But whatever the engine or whatever they're using for these newer games, I think it's getting better. And the quality of their games are getting better. And at the end of the day, whether this game focuses more on Bruce Wayne or Batman, I'm gonna play. It's not like their games are for like heavy 
action. It's not. It's all about the story. And that's what I care about when I play these types of games is the story. So as long as they bring with the story like they did with Walking Dead, Wolf Among Us, and I'll, I'll say Game of Thrones. I did enjoy Game of Thrones, but I thought, you know, Borderlands and Wolf Among Us was a, a lot better. Um, still haven't played Minecraft, so. <laughs> so I'm excited. What do you guys think? What do you think about Telltale taking on the Batman universe? And please give this video a thumbs up. Um, please leave a comment and let me know how you felt about this and what your expectations are for this game and we can talk about it. I, I really have hopes, high hopes that this is going to be one of the better games that Telltale has done because the song is such a cool character, you know? And um, it's going to help that he's so damn popular. Oh, thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe before you leave. I'll be seeing you sooner than later. I got some announcements coming up. So thank you to all my subscribers already. And thanks to everyone who's going to subscribe. And thank you so much for watching this video. It's Dean Marie Love on Keep It Scripted. Bye-bye.